Hello YouTube viewers. Today we're taking a closer look at the unforgettable cast of the iconic 1960 film The Magnificent Seven that has left an indelible mark on cinematic history. Steve McQueen Steve McQueen played the role of Vin Tanner, a broke gambler and a skilled marksman who joined the seven gunfighters for the adventure and the money. McQueen was born in 1930 in Indiana and served in the U.S. Marine Corps before pursuing an acting career. He appeared in films such as The Blob, The Great Escape, The Sand Pebbles, Bullet, and Papillon. He starred in The Magnificent Seven in 1960 and became one of the most popular film actors of his time. He also starred in other TV shows such as Wanted, Dead or Alive, Alfred Hitchcock Presents, and Track Down. He also produced films such as Le Mans, An Enemy of the People, and Tom Horn. He was married three times and had two children. He died in 1980 at the age of 50 from mesothelioma. Robert Vaughn Robert Vaughn played the role of Lee, a dapper gunman who joined the seven gunfighters to escape from his past enemies and regain his courage. Vaughn was born in 1932 in New York and graduated from Los Angeles State College with a degree in journalism. He started his career as a film actor and a TV actor before starring in The Magnificent Seven in 1960. He also appeared in films such as Bullet, Superman 3, The Towering Inferno, and B.A.S. Secondball. He also starred in other TV shows such as The Man from UNCLE, The A-Team, Hustle, and Coronation Street. He also wrote several books and memoirs such as Only Victims, A Study of Show Business Blacklisting, A Fortunate Life, and Robert Vaughn, A Hero's Journey. He was married once and had two children. He died in 2016 at the age of 83 from leukemia. Yul Brynner Yul Brynner played the role of Chris Adams, the leader of the Seven Gunfighters who was a veteran Cajun gunslinger and a man of few words. Brynner was born in 1920 in Russia and moved to the United States with his family when he was a teenager. He started his career as a stage actor and a singer before becoming famous for his role as King Moncut in The King and I, for which he won a Tony Award and an Oscar. He also starred in films such as The Ten Commandments, Anastasia, The Brothers Karamazov, and The Magnificent Seven. He starred in The Magnificent Seven in 1960 and became one of the most popular film actors of his time. He also starred in other TV shows such as The Ford Show, The Ed Sullivan Show, and The Hollywood Palace. He also wrote several books and memoirs such as Yul, The Man Who Would Be King and Bring Forth the Children. He was married four times and had five children. He died in 1985 at the age of 65 from lung cancer. Brad Dexter Brad Dexter played the role of Harry Luck, an old friend of Chris who joined the seven gunfighters hoping for a bigger reward than what was offered by the villagers. Dexter was born in 1917 in New York and served in the U.S. Army during World War II, where he was awarded a Purple Heart for his wounds. He started his career as a film actor and a producer before starring in The Magnificent Seven in 1960. He also appeared in films such as Run Silent, Run Deep, Kings Go Forth, Johnny Cool, and House Calls. He also produced films such as Shalako, Villa Rides, and The Delta Force. He also starred in other TV shows such as The Asphalt Jungle, The Virginian, The Name of the Game, and Vega Dollar. He was married twice and had no children. He died in 2002 at the age of 85 from emphysema. Charles Bronson Charles Bronson played the role of Bernardo O'Reilly, an Irish-Mexican gunfighter who joined the seven gunfighters out of sympathy for the villagers and befriended a young boy. Bronson was born in 1921 in Pennsylvania and served in the U.S. Army Air Forces during World War II, where he was awarded a Purple Heart for his wounds. He started his career as a film actor and a TV actor before starring in The Magnificent Seven in 1960. He also appeared in films such as The Dirty Dozen, Once Upon a Time in the West, Death Wish, and The Great Escape. He also starred in other TV shows such as Man with a Camera, The Travels of Jamie McFeeters, The FBI, and Hard Times. He was married three times and had four children. He died in 2003 at the age of 81 from pneumonia. James Coburn James Coburn played the role of Brit, a knife expert and a loner who joined the seven gunfighters for the challenge and the thrill. 
Coburn was born in 1928 in Nebraska and served in the U.S. Army during the Korean War. He started his career as a film actor and a TV actor before starring in The Magnificent Seven in 1960. He also appeared in films such as Our Man Flint, The Great Escape, and Like Flint, Pat Garrett and Billy the Kid, and Affliction. He also starred in other TV shows such as The Rifleman, Bonanza, The Muppet Show, and Monsters. He also won an Oscar for his performance in Affliction and received a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. He was married twice and had three children. He died in 2002 at the age of 74 from a heart attack. Horst Buchholz Horst Buchholz played the role of Chico, a young and impulsive Mexican who idolized the seven gunfighters and wanted to join them. Buchholz was born in 1933 in Germany and started his career as a stage actor and a film actor before starring in The Magnificent Seven in 1960. He also appeared in films such as One, Two, Three, Nine Hours to Rama, Marco the Magnificent, and Life is Beautiful. He also starred in other TV shows such as Disneyland, The Danny Kaye Show, The Zoo Gang, and Derek. He also won several awards for his acting such as the Bambi Award, the Golden Globe Award, and the David D. Donatello Award. He was married once and had two children. He died in 2003 at the age of 69 from pneumonia. If you enjoyed this video and want to stay updated with more content, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Your likes and subscriptions help us create more content and keep you informed. Now is the perfect time to click that like button and subscribe. Thank you, and see you in the next video.